Hi guys, welcome back. If you're here today, that's because you want to see how the new hollows from Zoya apply and how they look on the nail. And let me tell you, they are stunning. So Zoya recently created two new hollows in their very popular um, it's kind of like a jelly with a micro hollow flaky formula. Now they're re-promoting one of their other hollows, this one on this side. This is Brighton, and this is their neutral hollow, kind of slightly beigey ivory shade. And then these two over here are the new ones. So we're gonna swatch through all three of these today, just in case you haven't tried Brighton since they sent it to me with these two new hollows. I'm gonna go ahead and swatch all three. A couple other of their polishes that are in the same formula are Dream and Peyton. Here they are here. Dream is the blue and then Peyton is this beautiful deep berry eggplant shade and they are stunning. So because I always go in alphabetical order that means we're gonna start with Brighton. So Brighton, like I said, it's this neutral shade and it's kind of like a dirty ivory and I love it. It's so, so gorgeous. So you've got this kind of tanny gray cream base and it's filled with all of these micro hollow flakies, this ultra delicate, very small cut little micro hollow bits. And it makes for this very beautiful scattered hollow glow on the nail. And I think this one's really fun because you have it in a neutral, which I think isn't done as much as colored holographics. And so this one is very like office friendly. This one's very everyday. So this is Brighton and if you don't have it, I highly recommend it. The next polish in alphabetical order is the new pink that they created and this polish is called Cadence. And here it is, it's a very soft kind of, it's like a softened fruit punch to a rose. It's like if you mix a fruit punch and a rose. That's what I think about this pink. It's really beautiful, you guys. It has the same micro flakies in there. Cadence, I feel like, reaches opacity at two to three coats depending on your application. These are, for the most part, jelly bases, so they're gonna give you a nice squishy feeling on the nail. So if you wanna stop at those two coats, it's kind of more of a light wash of this beautiful pink shade with the hollow on the nail. I feel like Zoya just teases us with a few hollows now and then. Definitely snap these up. They are already on their website, so go ahead and snag them. Get Dream and Peyton while you're there too. They've been around for a little while. I almost forgot to tell you about the green version that's already been released. This is Merida. Grab Merida while you're there too. This is an ultra rich dark green, evergreen, that's not standing for me. So anyway, yes. <laughs> They do already have some hollows. Snag them, get these new hollows while you're there. And then the second new polish that they are releasing here is this red. It's kind of a candy red. I have it on my nails today. This is actually just one coat and I got pretty good coverage. So at two coats, you'll be good to go. I just wanted to see if I was like, if I just had a second to paint my nails. And I think it's totally passable. So um, yes, this polish is called Everly. And it's, like I said, it's kind of a candy red. It's really bright, but soft. And then you have all that gorgeous hollow. And reds aren't my favorite usually, but I really like this one. I really enjoy this formula that they've come up with to give a very soft wash of the jelly pigment and just tons of the hollow micro flakies. It's just beautiful. I really recommend these, you guys. I love them. In case you've been wondering what these are like, now you know you have a swatch of them and you can see how they perform. They performed beautifully, exactly like their other micro hollow flakies that are already in their line and I'm so happy that they've added a few more. So I hope you found this helpful. Let me know what you think down below. Thanks for stopping by for this video today and I will see you back very soon. Take care, bye.